Hi everyone, it's Mrs. Doss here to officially welcome you to the beginning of our Kindness Week. I don't know about you, but I, along with a lot of other staff members, have been really looking forward to this week um, and excited to share with you all the different things that we have planned. Now, some of them will be a surprise, so I can't share with them with you, um, but I do have some things that I can share with you today. Uh, so as you guys know that we have different dress-up days planned each day this week, we love our dress up days, especially down in the elementary school. And today is pajama day, a personal favorite of mine. So hopefully you have on your pajamas or if you don't have on your pajamas, maybe at least just something comfortable uh, to get our Monday started off with. So I have a couple of things that I wanna share with you guys. Um, and then I have a few staff members that have had an important role in making Kindness Week happen um, that wanna share a message with you. So Kindness Week is just kind of what it sounds like, um, an extra reason, a week that we've dedicated uh, to being kind, um, to kind to one another in the school building. And there's actually gonna be some opportunities where we can be kind to some community members around us. And so being kind to one another uh, is really important to making everyone, every student, every adult feel welcome, feel safe, feel loved when they enter South. And that is a place that we all wanna be. So I'm gonna share with you some things um, that will hopefully accomplish that message for all of us. And so we also are taking this week to celebrate uh, something called Spread the Word. It is a national campaign. So schools across the country um, are taking part of it. Um, that happens on March 2nd, but we decided to put our kindness week in at the same time so we can kind of maximize the impact. And the theme for Spread the Word is inclusion. Maybe some of you guys know what that means, or maybe for some of you, that's a new word. So I'll explain. So inclusion sounds kind of just what it like it starts out with. It's including others and making sure that everyone um, is taking part in things and everyone feels like South is their home. So we wanted to really do some activities um, that everyone felt included. Doesn't matter what you look like on the outside, where you came from, what your skin color is, your abilities, everyone deserves to feel welcome and feel that South is their home. So I'm going to share my screen with you guys to give you some sneak peeks on some things that we have. All right, so a lot of you guys have seen my website before, but if you come right up to the top, there's different things you can go to, but I have added a kindness library. So if you come over here, you're going to see this little thing. So you can click on it. And then when you go into it, there's actually like different books. And when you click on the books, it'll take you to a read aloud. So this is something that you can either do maybe when you have some free time to work on the Chromebook in class, or like maybe when you finish an assignment or even at home, you guys are welcome to get on this at any time. I'm gonna keep this up way beyond this week. Um, so they're all kindness books. Um, or talking about kind of inclusion, how we're making others feel included. And even the headphones have a little kindness song um, that you may like. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. I am going to send it out um, to all of your teachers so they can uh, send it to you guys or they can send you my website, okay? And then I also wanted to give you guys a sneak peek. These are our um, different themes coming up. So like I said, today's pajama day. Um, and then tomorrow, kindness is a superpower. So if you have any superhero clothing um, you want to wear, Wednesday's theme is kindness ties us together. So you can wear a tie. Thursday's is hats off to kindness. So you can wear a hat. And Friday is share the spirit of kindness. So if you have any school spirit wear, or even if you have a shirt or clothing at home that says something about kindness, I see a lot of kids with the different words on them, uh, feel free to wear it then. And so I just wanted to share with you guys a couple sneak peek uh, things. And then I'm going to kind of turn it over to a couple staff members, like I said, that had an important role um, in making Kindness Week happen or that it's just in, important to them. All right, guys, enjoy the week. I wanted to share one more thing 
to add to this week's kindness week, we're going to have a little bit of a friendly competition. So let me share with you what we're going to do. So we're going to have some kindness and inclusion challenges each day. So today on Monday, it's saying hi to someone new. I know that we get so used to being around our best friends. And of course, I encourage that for you to hang around people that make you happy. Um, but this week is all about including um, everyone and kind of reaching out to new people. Who knows? You might find a new friend, um, someone you might even known for a while. You just didn't know that you had so much more in common. So today is say hi to someone new, which we're just starting now. What I feel a little bit on the easier side. And then as we go through the week, maybe a little bit more challenging. So at the end of every day, if you completed this challenge, you're going to put a little tally mark. So every classroom will have this. And you're going to just put a little line if you did it. And so then at the end of the week, I'm going to have all the teachers turn it into me. And then we're going to count um, who kind of had the most. And there will be some uh, prizes at the end of the week that we will share. So we have on Tuesday, help someone. Um, I kind of put it broad because that can look differently. Maybe help someone pick something up or um, help someone if you see trash on the floor, um, even if it's not yours. Um, help someone open the door if you see they're carrying a lot of things. Uh, Wednesday, ask someone new what they like to do for fun. So not someone you typically hang around with, but you know, ask someone new. It doesn't have to be new to the school, but just new to you. Uh, Thursday, give someone new a compliment. So if you're not familiar with what a compliment means, that means just say something nice. Uh, you can compliment maybe something they do really well. You've noticed that they are really funny in class. They're always helping others. Um, or they're really great at math. Um, or give them a compliment on what they're wearing. And then on Friday, we're I'm going to challenge you to play with someone new at recess. Um, just maybe someone you see kind of maybe are they by themselves? They need someone to play with and join them or ask them to join your group. Um, or maybe you go play with someone new. Uh, so those are the challenges for this week. And so, like I said, if you complete it, just put the little tally mark there. And at the end of the week, we'll count and there will be a surprise. All right. Enjoy. Hi, boys and girls, it's Mrs. Springer, and it's Kindness Week at South this week, so I'm so excited. I hope that you all think of someone that you could do an act of kindness for, that you can say good morning to them, or I hope you have a good day, or give someone a hug, give your teacher an extra hug, give Mr. Scheider and Ms. D'Amico an extra hug, anyone in the school that's been helping you, let them know that you wanna share their, your kindness with all of them. I hope you all have a great week. I know I'm out in my backyard enjoying the weather today, but thinking out of all of you for this week. Bye. Inclusion is important because life is more fun with friends. When I think about kindness, I think about treating people how you wanna be treated. Um, I think it's important every day to get up and be intentional about doing kind things for others, about including others. And when you go to bed at night, reflect on your day and think about how you treated others and whether or not you included others. Uh, it doesn't cost anything to be kind. And one of the things I love about Licking Heights South is all the kindness I see from students, from staff, from everybody in the building. So let's take care of each other. Let's treat each other how we want to be treated. And let's have a great week and not just think about kindness today or this week, but always. Have a great day.